Hello everyone, welcome to my first video. Today I'm going to show my cigar collection. It's a pretty small collection. I have in this uh, humidor, it's a big smoke humidor. It has a 20 to 30 cigars capacity. I keep them fresh with these Movida packs and I use this little agrometer that is that has humidity and temperature so first of all i'm gonna st start with my the cheapest cigar i have i bought a box of 12 they are jose el piedra petit caballeros they are the box of 12 was around 33 euros so it they are pretty okay um I have five remaining and um, in the five remaining um, only one was bad, the, all the others, uh, Jose El Piedra Petit Caballeros were pretty okay, some even I say good, so I think it's a very good investment for money. Then we are going to the um, Vegueros Tapados, this one is also a uh, good smoke i find this brand to be quite underrated uh, but you need to age them just a little bit because if you don't age they're gonna be really peppery moving to this cigar this is the only new world cigar i have i keep them in the cellophane i don't know if that's the right thing i think it is and they are flor d'oliva robustos as you can see they are pretty okay price and they have really good construction it's a good cigar i appreciate it then i have these partagas seri di numero 4 and they are uh, i bought four singles at the time i smoked one i really liked it although it was still fresh a bit so i'm gonna give them so much they were 22 euros a cigar it's a bit expensive, but I think compensates. It's a bit ugly with these things to don't smoke because I bought them in singles, but it's not the most important thing. Then I have this Partagas Seri P number 2. They are really, they are really good. Um, I've smoked another box of three. They were all really good. Great construction. Uh, they are strong, but I quite enjoy it a lot. You have to eat something before you smoke them. You don't smoke them on an empty stomach, but yes, they are really good. Then my favorite of them all, Epicure number two. Unfortunately, this one has some sunspots but yes they still smoke the same not that pretty to look at but the flavor is what matters and i'm not really a cigar collector i'm more of a cigar smoker so yes it's not the the most important thing then continuing we have also the epicure number one it's also a pretty good cigar I quite prefer uh, the Epicure number two Vitola a little bit better, but this is um, also a, a cigar I quite enjoy a lot, and it's a bit um, cheaper than Epicure number two, has less demand, so it's easier to find them, and you still find, and you still have a pretty good smoke. And to finalize, Romeo and Julieta number two, also a pretty good cigar. I quite enjoy my cigars a bit on the uh, medium to mild uh, in most of other occasions. So, yes, Oyo and Romeo are my favorites, but in some occasions I prefer Partagas. If, if I'm drinking, I prefer something stronger. And I rearrange my cigars in year to medium to full bodies and full bodies and year to uh, mild to medium bodies and yes i hope you enjoyed this video i 
uh, going to keep growing my collection and uh, I'll soon do some reviews and some openings of things I have uh, coming soon. Have a good one and goodbye.